troubles as well. Thank you for just being able to worship you, to praise you, God, to bring glory to your name. Yes. I pray that everyone here feels blessed yes. and yes. happy and to sing loud to you, God. You deserve so much glory. Yes. You deserve so much praise. Yes. And God, I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart and to the top of my head. God, thank you so much for loving us. Thank you for letting us come here tonight to praise you, God. I pray you feel loved and cherished. We pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. First, I would like to give honor and thanks to my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, my pastor, Reverend Fetch, the choir members of Good Hope, and all the invited choirs who have come to grace this occasion with their presence. Good Hope members and all invited guests, I greet you in the name of Jesus. This is a special occasion that the Lord has given us to be able to gather here today as we worship our Lord through music. So I welcome you to our church, and I hope everyone will enjoy and be blessed by all the choirs that we have lined up today. Thank you. for the greater new life praise team they're gonna open, um, do some uh, a selection for us and we asked them to come on up and thank you Ah, what a wonderful day. Thank the Lord for uh, for you all coming here and being a part of this great celebration and uh, it's, it's, it's good to be here. Good to be here. I've counted an honor and a privilege that I was asked uh, to uh, to be a part of this this uh, this celebration. I wanted to know, and I'm just going to ask this to the to the to the to the audience here. Did you all know that singing is not an option? <laughs> singing is actually a command. Yes. Now I asked for people looking at me kind of strange, and as as my pastor would say, I've got yeah. Bible. Go ahead. <laughs> That's Mother Springfield people here that know what I'm talking about. <laughs> In the word, in Colossians 3.16, it says, Let the word of Christ dwell in you richly, teaching and admonishing one another in all wisdom, singing songs and hymns and spiritual songs with thankfulness in your heart to God. That's a command. So, I am so grateful to see all of those who are here to follow God's command. Amen. And you in the audience aren't exempt now. Don't, don't think because you're not in the choir or one of the groups, because we're gonna have we're gonna have a good time in the name of the Lord today. Amen. And uh, I, I look for one of these groups, some of them I know, some of them I know, but I think we got a good variety here. Everybody's not a choir here. So we're gonna have some quartet singing going on in here. Yeah. I'm looking forward to that because it's been a while since I heard trying to start right. <laughs> I hadn't heard it. I'm not familiar with, but I, but I do know Malvish Crossroad Choir. I, 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 I've heard them, and I'm um, looking forward to that. Just to let you all know who's coming, so you can get prepared. And then we have Evangelist Mary Frances Price Wilson, who's coming from the Greater Life Ministry, and I'm looking forward to that. Well, because we got them coming from all over the place. We got listen, Wade Forrest, Durham, Nightdale, Raleigh. We're looking at having a wonderful time in the name Amen. of the Lord. Jubilant is here. And I'm, I'm hoping that you all are here when I say you're here. Uh, Evangel Baptist Ensemble Ministry. Uh, that's, my, that's my uncle there. Pastor, Amen. Pastor Dunn, Bishop Dunn. And then Redeemed Disciples. Amen. I hope you all are here. And if you're not, please come let me know so I won't embarrass myself by saying, come on up here, you're not here. Um, right now, I saw a lot of purple around here. I don't know if you all know, purple is, is a symbol of royalty. And, uh, and, 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 and I saw a lot of purple coming in here, and I think it's coming from...
right before we do the first selection, we got to do a moment of silence. If you notice on the back of your program, the Lord saw fit to call one of our faithful choir members home this past week. Deacon Randolph, as we call him, Randy Goodson. And this program has been dedicated to his memory. And when we think about it, we think about the melodies from heaven. Well, we know if Randy could be here, he would be here with us. But we know that he was a surprise to the whole church family and to his family. So right now we're going to do a moment of silence and Deacon Goodson's memory. Yeah. 
talks about how wonderful and how awesome our God is. The songwriter wrote, because of who you are, I give you glory. Give the Lord a hand clap.
12 of us. It's 12 of us still living. She must stay with twins. I didn't know you were wearing that coat shirt. <laughs> you used to make set me, girl. Yeah. <laughs> That's all right. Okay, praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. At the gate, I know.
The devil does. We never let go of God's hand. He's worthy of the praise. He's worthy of the glory. He's worthy of the honor. Hallelujah. He's worthy. Worthy.
make sense to sing a song if you can't hear the words, is that right? That's true, so I don't Y'all, if we get too loud, I want somebody to raise your hand like that and tell us we're too loud, right? Check this. Check. It's good to be here today. Check, check. I'd like to say congratulations to the choir.
Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. I love you all.